Hey guys, so if you've seen my video where I make the Baby Alive food packets, um, I didn't know how to make the thin colors, so you'd have to bring colored water to make it work. But Natalia Santis, she suggested something that is so brilliant, I just had to make another video all about it. I'm going to teach you how to make it. So, I'm just getting down my packet paper. I still have my packet paper from earlier. Yeah. Okay. So, I'm going to make my packet the exact same way. Like, um, the thing about the three inches by three inches was a really good sizing. I'm happy that it came out like a good size. go. So I've got it made and like I did before, I'm going to fold in half. Oh, if you didn't see that video, um, we're making Baby Alive food packets. So, and these time, this time they are going to be colored. So you're going to fold, draw a square three by three and then fold on one of the lines. Then you want to cut up your other line and across this Pop. So you have a little packet like this. Someone else, I forget who, suggested that you could tape the whole thing, make the food, and put it in there so it would be waterproof. But I don't know how long the food would last and if it would spoil. And I know this way it will not spoil. And like I did before, you can just cut out um, the same size and shape thing. And then have another little one. This could even be a long little one. I don't know. So. Alright. Once you have that done. Um, you want to get like a marker or something. And make like your brand name or whatever. I like to keep a certain brand. But um, I'm going to change it. The first kind of baby food I'm going to make is going to be banana. So I'm going to make yellow and it's going to say banana food. Banana baby food, that's better. Then I'm going to draw a banana. So, there we go. And on the back I'm going to write, um, contains one serving that's true and I'm also going to add add water to activate that way I know how to use it so there we go so now I've got this cute banana baby food and you want to tape up the sides just as before It's crooked. Got to make it a little bit longer. And then I have to tape up the other side. Whoops. Where did it go? Natalia, I really want to thank you for giving me this awesome idea because then I won't have to bring colored water. I can just bring regular water or whatever. I won't have to bring markers. If you just want to take this for like a really quick place, like if you're going somewhere and like, I don't know, just you don't want to bring your whole diaper bag. You won't have to bring a bunch of stuff. I got cat hair on mine, but I really don't care. So then you want to you're going to want to put your powder in there. I don't have any powder with me right now. Um, so I'm going to... I want to make my other ones. I'm going to make some... Um, strawberries. I'm going to use pink. I just 
need to add some little seeds to make it really cute. Aww. Strawberry baby food. And I'm going to write the exact same thing on the back. You can do any flavor you want. That's what's cool about this. And I'm going to make a bunch of flavors. So it says contain one serving and then add water to activate. And then I want to tape up the sides of this once again. That was like the perfect size piece of tape. I'm surprised I got it so perfect. Let's see if I got this one perfect. Yep. Oh, I went a little over. That's okay. So now I've got two. I've got banana and strawberry, and I want to do one more. I think I might do like carrots or blueberries or green veggies or cherries. I think I might do carrots. Carrots, baby food. I'm going to draw a carrot. Carrots are easy to draw. There we go. Uh, hold on, it needs a little detail. So I've got these, this carrot, and then I'm going to write again the exact same thing on the back. I'm going to make a bunch of these because these are really fun, easy, and good for on the go and for when you run out. Same thing, and I'm going to tape up the sides once again. I was uh, quite a bit short there. It's better to write your thing beforehand so you don't have to right over tape because that does not work out. Oops. I also don't like getting my tape not straight. I went quite a bit over on this one. It's pretty over. So I'm going to go add some powder to these and I'll be right back. Flour I mean. So I just went and got some flour. Um, I'm going to start by putting a few scoops in there. Um, you could use like a little bit more. Feels good. Try dumping it. Yeah, no, whatever. Um, <laughs> it's a smaller container, but still works. I just need a little bit more. Perfect. So now I'm done with my flour. And right now you're probably like, this is the exact same as your last video. But here is where it gets completely different. Alright, so Natasha, I think I said her name was. I don't remember anymore, but um, she said that if you know what, you're go what baby food you're going to be making, you usually put in the paper towels with color on them, so why don't you just put them in the packet? I thought that was brilliant. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. I'm going to take a paper towel and the color marker that I want. This is going to be for my banana. So you just want to color like 
a really good even amount. And I'm trying to be careful with this one because I want it to be able to fit into my baby food package. And I'm coloring on a surface that doesn't matter if it gets marker on it because I'm trying to get a ton onto this so you can see it. And I want to cut it precisely with my scissors, but you do not have to do that. You can just let it do whatever you want if you want to. Mm-hmm. Cutting, cutting, cutting. So there we go. So now I've got this like really yellow piece of paper towel and I'm going to stick it in with my flower and then tape up the top. I'm going to do the same for all the other ones. But my parents are calling me down for supper, so I'm going to do those when I get back. At least I think they're calling me, unless they're calling my brother. And I just ripped off the tape. Of course I did, why wouldn't I? You want to be very careful that you don't mess up and rip off the top. And you just want to be able to... Yeah, I've got a little corner that's spilling some. So the corners are what you really want to be careful of. Alright. Um, I guess they're not calling me. Okay, so I'm going to make the pink one now for the strawberries. Eh, tape on me. They're calling my brother, so that must mean the corn isn't ready yet. Second. Yeah, now they're calling me. And I just rip the strawberry stuff. Alright. So now we've got this pink one. I'm going to stick inside the strawberries. There we go. I feel like the corners are not so secure on this one. Especially that corner. The other corner I feel secure about. And the carrots. I'm just going to cut this now while well, it is easy. And then color it in orange. So, thank you, whatever I said your name was at the beginning that I remembered then, but not now, for suggesting this. It was a brilliant idea. I never would have thought of this. I don't know why I didn't think of this. This is, like, the best hack for making baby alive food. And I cannot color this not working. <laughs> there we go. And I will have to go down for dinner, but I've got my orange. I'm going to stick it in. It's a little bit big, but I can make it work. I can even fold it up. There we go. So there you have it, baby, baby alive food packets, and all you need to do is add water to activate them. So thanks for watching, please click like and subscribe, and let me know in the comments if you think this was brilliant, and if it was way better than my, my original idea, which it is.